name is Wendy Norris. I'm with Frey Norris, Contemporary and Modern, and we are based in San Francisco, California. This is our third year at Art Dubai, and it's one of my favorite fairs of the several that I participate in around the world, including Hong Kong and New York. This is the artwork of Shireen uh, Girgis. She's an Egyptian artist living in California. This is her debut in the Middle Eastern region. Uh, she grew up in Cairo since she was 17. And these paintings uh, remind her of her childhood, not only of the colors, um, of the textiles and food that she saw on the streets of Cairo, but also in the um, explosive patterns and the movement and the chaos of the streets. And they're very detailed. Um, on the back, she paints a beautiful reddish pink color, which if you see here, casts shadows of pink onto the white. And she uses gold leaf around the edges of these cut out, very finely cut out patterns. These patterns come from traditional screens that you'll find in countries like Egypt, screens that typically separate the men from the women. So there's a bit of allure, a bit, a bit of uh, subtle feminist statement in these works. Um, they're clearly uh, beautiful with lots of movement and vibrant pigments. This is a night, another piece by Shireen Girgis. It's a three-dimensional sculpture um, called Mashrabeya, which means a scream. And again, she's using these patterns, ornate patterns, um, with plywood that's laser cut. Uh, and the three pieces here that kind of go together like a, a toy um, remind me of mid-century modern furniture from California or maybe from Japan. So furniture pieces from the, the 50s as an example. And the image here is, is really, again, another explosion. This one more reminiscent of an atomic bomb, in my opinion. The art scene in Dubai and in the Middle Eastern region is very exciting right now. And in working in this region for three years, I've seen lots of progress. And the art fair and the quality of the fair and the participants keeps getting better. I really like the collectors in the region. I like their thoughtfulness and the way in which they go about making decisions carefully um, in a way that I think is ultimately benefiting uh, the artists in their careers and, and also the galleries that choose to fly over here and, and participate. So I'm really uh, a big fan of the region and how they're um, approaching the arts and cultural scene here.